Sing Tanushi story is growing leaps and bounds in the field of education. STM Law College recently conducted. Scores of students were enrolled at St. Agnes College. Pretty tough business to be. Namma campus side. Good evening viewers. Welcome to Campus Eye, the show that brings you news from colleges around Mangalore. This is your host Harmad Khan. Let's look at this week's events. Golden Jubilee celebration conducted by St. Aloysius Evening High School. A rally was conducted on Tibetan National Uprising Day by the Tibetan students of Mangalore. Victoria Uris 2014, the National Law Fest opened new experience for the budding law students at SDM College. Farewell day conducted for the senior staff members at St. Aloysius College. Last official function of St. Aloysius College become memorable one. St. Aloysius Evening High School celebrated Golden Jubilee. Campus Air reporter Pragadi brings you more details. St. Aloysius. Sandhya Pradashanya Vidyatikalu. Indu ee huttu sona mocha vashashana ena maadta dare. Innashtu suddhikalu nimma campus ayana. संध्या प्रौढ़शाले वर्ष पूरेक सवर्ण महोत्सव वर्षाचरण मार्च संजे गंटे तौढ़शाल सभांगण हमको कार्यक्रम से संध्या प्रौढ़शाल मुख्योपाध्याय रेवरेन्ड फादर एडवर्ड रोडिगस् उप मुख्योपाध्याय मिस्टर अमित बर्बोजा कार्यक्रम निरूपक मिस्टर क्यामेल रेबेलो हल व्यार्थी पालक हितैषी पागर कार्यक्रम मुख्य अतिथि कॉर्पोरेटर शाल हल व्यार्थी एसी वनयराज मतना व्यु नमेंगे साधि शक्तिया युवक व्यावंतर समाज अभिवृद्धि श्रम शाले कल वर्ष सतत प्रयत्न पड़े कार्यक्रम अध्यक्ष वह अलूशियस् व्यासंस्थे रेक्टर फादर डेनिल लोबो एसजे शाल शिषण वंचित शिक्षित सदुदेश आरंभग व्यार्थी आत्मविश्वास श्रद्धा मुदे सुरी साधि साधक जीवन गाथे व्यार्थी दारदीपू संस्था सिब्बंदी वर्ग दैंपस् एनोदना सवर्ण महोत्सव आचरण संभव मन मुटे प्रोत्साह अभी नम मकल संख्य बहुत कड़म मूर् जन नम फन वाले रीतलीकुग्दार ना ये कूड़ा नम मू रेडिया चेनिमा नमें अब बहुत खुशिया जनसंख्य जास्ति कारण नमेंद नोड़ी बहुत सतोषव शाल व्यार्थी नांस्कृतिक कार्यक्रम सभिकर रंजित आगस्ट इपत् सवि हनर शाल मुख्योपाध्याय रेवरेन्ड फादर जॉन् क्रास्ट एसजे नायकत् आरंभव संभ्रमाचरण इंदूटन स्टूडेंट फ्रम डिफरेन्ट कॉलेज अरउंड मैंगलूर कमेटेड फिफ्टी फिफ्थ टिबेटन याशनल अप्रेसिंग डे ऑन मार्च टेन On March 10, 1959, China's People Liberation Army surpassed Tibetan revolt against China's military rule in the capital city of Tibet. Since then, Tibetans all around the world commemorate the day as National Uprising Day. For the last 55 years, Tibetans living in exile in India and all around the world are unable to return to their homeland. They have high aspiration to return to Tibet. Yonten Funsuk, a mass communication student from St. Aloysius College, spoke to Campus Eye. 
It is highly privileged that we Tibetan people can carry a demonstration in India without having any restrictions that we don't actually enjoy in Tibet. I just want to say a few words uh, on behalf of the Tibetan people who are living in India and who carried out that protest uh, protest on 10 March, which we mark the day as uh, Tibetan National Abrasion Day. Uh, no matter how the China, Chinese government is big or huge, the spirit of the Tibetan people will never die and we will fight against uh, the forceful occupation of China until we, got, uh, we, we will get back to Tibet uh, with the unified along with the, uh, our uh, leader, Mr. Kunal, is the Dalai Lama. The events included with the 7 kilometers peace march from Vijay to Nehru Medan in the morning. The motive of the march was to showcase solidarity to Tibetans who are living in Tibet and creating awareness about Tibetan political adversaries among Indian publics. SDM Law College conducted a four-day national level law fest, Victoria Uris 14. SDM Law College and Center for Postgraduate Studies and Research in Law Manglu conducted four days national level law fest, Victoria Iris 2014, the victory of law. Sri B. V. Prakash, Honorable District and Senior Judge, Dakshina Kannada District, inaugurated the function. Dr. B. K. Ravindra, Principal and Chairman of the Moot Court Society, presided over the function. The program included different competitions like negotiation, trial advocacy, mediation, etc. Competitions mainly aimed to give a practical exposure to the students who are going to the legislative field. Staff Program Coordinator Dr. Taranath spoke to Campus I about the experience and objectives of the program. The format of this competition is something like trial advocacy, appellate advocacy, client interview, negotiation, mediation, etc. So more or less, 19 law colleges across India have responded. So at the end of the day, all the students have participated in an enthusiastic manner. So ILI Pune got the first place, which is followed by KLE of Bank. So this is the way we did our Victoria Ace 2014, which is a huge success. And hope that in the next academic year, we would like to go for an international level of competition. Mangalore Jesuit Educational Society arranged farewell for its staff members. Campus A reporter Alfie De Cruz brings you more details. Today, Mangalore Jesuit Education Society gives farewell to the St. Aloysius faculty members. The ceremony started with a prayer song by the teaching staff of the institution. Campus I spotted eminent personalities of the Aloysius institution and the Jesuit society gracing the occasion with their presence. The welcome speech delivered by Reverend Father Sweeper De Silva, SJ, Principal St. Lucius College, gave a refreshing feel to the audience. All the retired faculty members were individually honored. The outgoing staff were Mr. Valdry Vegas, Mr. Leroy Manduka, Srimati Leela, Srimati Clara De Souza, and Mr. George Lobo, who were present with momentous garland, fruit basket and a shawl as a sign of goodwill and gratitude. In the farewell message, Reverend Father Denzel Lobo, SJ, Rector St. Lucius College said in his farewell message, It's not us who have given them a gift, it's them who have been a gift to our college. The event was concluded with a vote of thanks delivered by Reverend Father Francis D. Almeida, SJ. Srimati Clara D'Souza, one of the retired faculty members, shared her feelings and experience with Campus I. Bahu Kala Seveyanu Salisidene Idu Nanage Bahala Undu Santasada Vishaya Tia Sanste Yu Bahala Undu Uleya Sanste Illi Taratamya Villa Puina Sarvuto Muka Abivratige Yi Sanste Yu St. Lucius College celebrated Degree Day with all its heart and colors. Campus A brings you more details. Last official function of the academic year 2014, the Degree Day has been celebrated by St. Lucius College, Mangalore. It was filled with colors, talent and hard work. Extraordinary performance of students 
steal the mind of audience. Reverend Father Suibert D. Silva S.J., Principal of St. Lucius College, presided over the function. Chief guest of the function was Dr. A.M. Narahari, Registrar of the St. Lucius College, and the librarian Dr. George Rodriguez. Presentation of Student Council Report, Exchange of Scroll, Felicitation for the retiring staffs were included in the function. Power packed culture program by the students made the function memorable. Enthusiastic performance grabbed the heartbeat of the viewers. Wishes of outgoing final year students by juniors were also a part of Degree Day. One of the final year students from St. Lucius College shared his experience with Campusite. The Student Council works with the cooperation students, so because of that, it should not be only the Student Council Day, but it should be the Degree Day as well. That is, the elected members and the voters together who form the college and to shape it to what it is. That's all for this week's Campusite. We'll see you next week. This is your host Harmut Khan signing off. St. Aloysius College is growing leaps and bounds in the field of education. STM Law College recently connected. Scores of students were enthralled at St. Agnes College. Study campus is a big... Give me a moment. Namma campus is a big...